everyone and welcome to another £100 challenge. Today we're in Sainsbury's and the reason I've decided to come here is because I'm on a gluten and dairy free diet and a lot of you guys said go to Sainsbury's because they've got the best range so I'm going to be looking and probably spending a lot on that and we're going to have a look and see what else they have in store. They have lots of items reduced to clear in here, including Brita Fun Jugs. They have this purple one for £9, but if you get the pink one, it's £8.10, and they're both reduced from £18. I'm now in the chilled section, and I've found these six gluten-free sausages from the Black Farmer. And if you haven't tried the Black Farmer sausages, they are delicious. When this brand first came out, I actually emailed them asking if they had any coupons, and they sent me some for a free product and I've been a customer ever since, so it really does pay to email brands. So this is the first item in my trolley today. The next item we're going to be buying is this pack of vegan cheese slices. This is by Violife and they are so delicious. But Callum's just spotted this vegan pizza and I said, but it won't be gluten free. But apparently it is. And it's smoky, what is that? Mozzarella. So I'm guessing a vegan cheese alternative, spinach, olives and tomato. The only thing, they are five pound. And I think I can create one cheaper than that. But it was handmade by Sally. See, that's really nice when you get things what are actually handmade and not like... Machine production. Yeah. yeah. A few weeks ago, I tried this innocent unsweetened coconut milk and it's two pound, but it was delicious. And I normally find unsweetened milk alternatives are really horrible, but this wasn't. So I'm going to be getting another one of those today. What are you looking at, Cal? I thought it was a coupon, but it's not. It's just an information ticket. I was disappointed. I've just found this Nando salt and Callum went, oh, I love that stuff. But I'm checking to see if it's gluten free. It actually does look like it is. I don't think I'm going to be eating this, but do you want to get some for yourself? Yeah. Okay. Put it in here. It's got straight and much for We're now going to get some baked beans and the four packs are actually more expensive than buying four single ones. Always look out for that because sometimes you just grab the multi-packs. So we're going to be getting four of these today. This is random because we've been going up and down the food aisles but now we're at technology, when technology was originally all the way up there. But they do have some good offers. They have this DAB radio for £35. It was 50 And down here they have a red toaster down from 35 to 1750 And this Active Blend Breville, I think that's how you pronounce it, for £22.40. We've now found the gluten-free section. It's right at the back of the store, where it used to be right at the front. And this is a trick what supermarkets do. So you have to walk around longer, so you buy more things. You might have heard about that on Chain Dawson's documentary. I was actually thinking about doing a supermarket conspiracy video, because I know lots of tricks what they do to get you to buy things, and a lot what he didn't mention. So if you'd like that, let me know in the comments below. But I'm going to have a look through some of these items. They've got chocolate eggs which are also dairy free, which are perfect for vegans, but these have stood out. I never thought I'd be able to eat free from millionaire shortbreads. So hopefully, oh yes, free from gluten, wheat, dairy, egg, and vegan. And these are two pound, which is really reasonable actually. So they're going in the trolley and I'm gonna have a look at everything else. Vegan mayo, definitely need to try that. It's gluten, egg and dairy free and it's £1.50. We're now in the ice cream section and I've found these Cornettos and they're made with soy and gluten free. They're £3 so I'm going to give those a try. I've just found a free from freezer section and there's not a lot to choose from because it's all wheat free and gluten free, not milk. The only products I could find which are milk free are these chicken dippers and they're three pounds so I'm going to put them in my trolley for a snack. And they also have these codfish fingers so I'm going to be grabbing those too. I am so shocked how small the freezer section is in this same freeze. It's just this aisle because if I come round here it's the soda aisle so i was going to stock up on some free from products in the freezer range but they've hardly got any which are milk free too so we're going to just do our regular shopping for the girls now to make sure we hit 100 pound cream soda callum loves cream soda that's how we're going to hit the 100 pound 
I bought a can of this Pepsi Max Ginger in Home Bargains a while back and my dad was like oh it's so delicious and it's £3 in here so I'm going to get this for him because he's always popping in our house, he randomly walks in. He doesn't even knock, he just walk in sometimes, he's got a key so he'll just go straight in, thank you very much. Yeah but my family is very much like that though, you don't understand it do I you? I was asleep today, I heard the front door open, I was like I'm getting robbed, I'll run downstairs and he just stand there at the fridge, I'm like... Yeah so my dad... My dad goes straight to the fridge, so we're going to make sure it's stocked up for him. Cola Zero by Sainsbury's. At first glance, I thought that was Coke Zero, so good design, Sainsbury's. And it's 65p. Not sure if it'll be good or not. I kind of want to try it. I'm going to try it because I do like my Zero Cola. And I'll tell you what we've got to look for in here today is some Claudial because people told me I can't drink Vinto anymore. I never knew it had uh, barley malt. I know, I'm so sad. But people are like, you're gluten free and you're drinking Vimto. So I have to pick something different. I don't really like Ribena, so I think I'm going to go for a Robinson's. But look, it's torn to me now. Look. Why do they put barley in it? Here we go, up here. No added sugar. Brilliant. I also want the one what you squeeze in what we had when we were in Orlando if you can find it oh this store is really letting us down today absolutely I'm also going to be buying some Nando's products because they are gluten free as far as I'm aware I have been eating Nando's for quite a while they have this coat and cook lemon and herb they also have the lemon and herb sauce and this marinade and I like to make my own Nando's at home so I get some McCain chips which is what they actually use in the restaurant and I also get a chicken marinade it and then half it so I make my half chicken and chips looking at the trolley it doesn't look anywhere near 100 pound but it might be because some of this gluten-free stuff is really expensive so just to make sure we do hit our total we're back up the chilled section and we're going to be getting some chicken breast but i'm really gutted they didn't have any pizza bases because i really wanted to make my own pizza callum's just checking some eggs right now so let's have a look they've got these british fresh whole chicken breast fillets Oh look, they've got little recipe cards. I've added four beef burgers and a chicken, but looking at it, I don't think it's £100. So we're now down the cloven aisle, and I've spotted this Aurora. And it's actually in Bella's age, and she loves Aurora. So I'm going to be buying this for her today, and we're going to keep an eye out for something for Molly. I've just looked at the price tag of this and it's actually half price so that's really good six pound and they have a bell one at the back so hopefully I can find it in Molly's size she'll be good in a seven to eight won't she as well because she's diddy oh look how pretty that is they're ideal for six pound I'm trying to spend money and the stuff still comes up half price I also want to show they have aerial ones. Look how pretty those are. For £6, that is amazing. So you're going to put it there. They've got quite a lot half price actually. Look, even the dressing gowns and stuff. So we're going to check out with this and we'll keep you updated if we have actually passed the £100 mark. Which you never know because this gluten free food is quite expensive. As part of the Red Nose range, they have these surprise boxes and they're only one twenty-five each. So I thought I'd get a couple for Molly and Bella to unbox on their channel. If you want to subscribe, I'll leave it in the description below. And it's time to go home because I'm losing my voice. I'm just sitting down watching Callum pack because he doesn't like me doing it. Because it's got to be in a certain order. All the frozen in one bag, look at that. Now get all the chill in one bag, look at that. I just bung it in and he hates it. So I'll update you in a minute with the total. Thank you. Callum. Oh, great pan off. That is darn good though. 97. So yeah, failed, but we were so close. Oh, that's good enough. Sorry, that is good enough. So thank you for watching. If you haven't already, please hit subscribe. And until next time, we will see you soon. Bye. Bye.